Karma and welcome to my art space. I'm actually here at the mall for a gastro checkup, but while waiting for the doctor, I came here also to check out a really, really nice cafe. So I hope you will join me in this video and see what I'm going to paint. quite rare for me to get out of the house these days. That's why I was quite excited when I needed to go to Manila for a gastro checkup. But before meeting the doctor, I needed to take my lunch here at the rooftop garden at Trinoma. And for the first time, I'll be trying out Cafe Breton. Established in 1998, this locally owned restaurant is known for its crepes and galettes. I'll first try something that's fit for lunch. I tried spaghetti which costs 225 pesos or $4.37 and the mango smoothie which costs 150 pesos or $2.91. I think this spaghetti is a refined version of the Filipino spaghetti. It has lots of meat and cheese and it's not very sweet just like other Filipino spaghetti. I find this one really delicious. Now that I've finished my spaghetti, I'll try the mango shake while waiting for my crepe. This is the Jibu. It is priced at 305 pesos or $5.92. It has a generous filling of mangoes and it's served with cream. Mmm, yum. I hope my doctor won't be mad at me for eating quite a bit much today. <laughs> I chose to place near the window because I was planning to paint. But since there's only about an hour left before I go to the clinic, I would just wait and watch the beautiful scenery outside. I'm almost finished with my meal. But I forgot to tell you an important thing that makes this crepe so special. The vanilla ice cream. Uh-huh, it's very heavenly. I believe that the price of the mango shake was too high, but since it's fully loaded with mangoes, I think I should reconsider my opinion. Bottoms up! Ah, it seemed that the heavens are crying with me because it's only a short visit, but I'll make sure to come back to Cafe Breton soon. I returned about one month later to make a follow-up checkup. And while waiting for my appointment, I came back to Cafe Breton. While eating my lunch, I'll also be making a gouache painting. I'm glad I always have my gouache paints with me. For starters, I had macchiato alla Nutella. This espresso shot is only 140 pesos or $2.67. And here comes galet paisan, which would surely make a heavy meal for 385 pesos or $7.35. 
I love the fact that galit paisan seems to be a complete meal for me. Especially that it has Hungarian sausage, asparagus, and eggs. This one's really nice. I love how the cheese sauce complemented well with the asparagus. Time to perk up with some espresso shot. I forgot that the Nutella has sunk beneath the glass, so I need to stir it up to make the macchiato taste a bit sweeter. Now that's better. I've been wanting to paint this plant ever since I first came to this cafe. I first worked on the leaves because I want to start off with the most complicated part of the picture. When you see plants, don't they just make you happy? They make me so happy that I want to keep them not only in my memory, but also in my canvas. Painting the leaves took the longest time because of its details, and the rest is easier. But when I say it's easy, it's not really that easy. Because you still have to make sure that you're catching the light and the shadows correctly. Like this vase, for example. Throughout this part, I was thinking, was I getting the right light and the right reflection? But I did not expect that the color pink would be the biggest challenge in this painting. I thought I could easily get the right hue for this color by just mixing white and red. But the combination turned a bit dull. I tried mixing white and red with a bit of yellow, but it turned out to be a bit orangey. I felt sad that it turned out not to be as bright pink as it should be. I think I should buy a bright pink paint if I'm going to paint something with that kind of color. But if anybody knows the right color combination to get bright pink, please share in the comment section. Phew! I couldn't believe I'm done in just about an hour and a half. This visit would not be complete without the dessert. Do try this strawberry cobbler. For 170 pesos or $3.24. Aside from the food, I love Cafe Breton because of the quaint, homey vibe the place gives. The staff is also nice and accommodating, and I was not disturbed all along while painting. I even ordered an extra because I wanted to eat dessert. The gillette was really, really heavy actually. I hope my doctor will not scold me for this. <laughs> I, I'm actually okay. I feel my, my stomach's fine. Although I still have acid reflux from time to time. And it's amazing that I'm able to eat dessert. <laughs> Heavenly. Well, thank you again, and hope you see I see you again in the next video. Bye. Hmm. Guys, alam mo ba? Patabanan man ako. Kaya ka ice cream pa ice cream pa more ah. May konting chika. Sinina yung manager. Pinicture niya yung painting ko kasi natuwa siya dun sa ginawa ko. <laughs> Sabay promote na rin ang vlog ko. <laughs> Sana, hi! Sana mapansin niyo. <laughs> natuwa ko talaga ako sa food. Yung nakalimutan ko na ngayon pangalan ko. I promise, natuwa talaga ako sa food. Huwag niyo na po ako papapasokin dito next time para hindi po ako tumapag. Sarat lang po. <laughs>